Hey everybody, how are you? Let me see if this is uh it's gonna cricket, right? But anyways, it's okay. I'm back in Cheyenne, Wyoming, and this is gonna be another Valentine's design, a very simple and easy with just only two balloons. So this can be like a for a line twist, something really cute. This time it's a pink one and it's a rose bracelet. Yeah. It's a rose bracelet and it can this type of rose you can make it also with the stamp long and make a bunch of those and make a bouquet. But this time I just go with simple with the bracelet idea. And we're gonna do this right now. So we're gonna start with the flower part, the petals. That is gonna be uh 160 balloon inflated, like eight finger tail, nine finger tail. And you're gonna start making three pinch trees. So it's like one finger bubble, another one finger bubble, another one finger bubble, but all these finger bubbles are gonna make pinch trees. So you just make it the way you do you prefer to make your pinch trees. My okay, so there's three pinch twists. Yep, okay, then you're gonna squish and make soft one finger bubble, and then you're gonna make a three finger bubble, one finger bubble, another three finger bubble, and connect these two together. Now we're gonna do this again two more times three finger bubble, one finger bubble, three finger bubble, and twist them. Again, three finger bubble, one finger bubble, and three finger bubble, and twist it. Okay, so we have this. Yep, now when you have this, now with the rest, you're gonna squish, and you're gonna pass this better from the inside. This is what I did, you see? This is from the inside of that rose. And we are going to actually make pinch twists to each of these bubbles that one finger bubble this one let's make it into pinch twist pinch twist and pinch twist okay now we're gonna grab this part and we're gonna squish the air and make a very skinny bubble look you see i'm squishing the air it's very skinny and twist it to this first pinch twist so then we're gonna just connect all this and make it more like this angle close it so we're gonna just go around here, like three finger bubble, oh, another three finger bubble, and another three finger bubble. Make sure these pinch twists are in the same level or, you know, that's better, I think. Something like this, you see? Okay, let's see. Now with the rest, it is better if you want, you know, like your flower more open, if, they, if we go around again but you can play to make some shapes for example it can go from down the pinch twist up to the the other pinch twist so you can make this angle and that's optional and it all depends how much uh balloon do you have right so you just go and play with that shape but you, the idea is you just go from one side to the other sometimes work sometimes no okay so that's what I'm doing, and if it's getting too tight, remember, you can make a little hole. Oh, but don't lose all the air. <laughs> and now, it's a good reason to show you. This is a 160 pump that in Miami, I forgot to, to bring it. You know, I want to be practical. I only take, you know, my 260 balloon inflator. So I forgot this one. But this is great to blow very easy and fast the 160 balloons. Okay, now keep going. You just grab the rest and pass it to the other side, the next side. So then you twist it, tie it, and look, there you go. So this will have your rose open. Now, the next step, you just grab a 160 balloon, inflate it, let's see, um, like, let's see, like three finger tail. And this part is gonna be connected here. So we're just gonna pass it from one side open there the loops and pass it and find it to the other side so it can be a little bit uh because it's tied there but it is possible so you just keep finding the other side and because it's already tied there you just need to maybe just make sure to pass the nozzle to the other side and then like this way and then you just twist 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 and that's gonna be good enough okay and then go and hide in there and then after that you're gonna measure like 
four finger bubble and make the next loop, twist it, and then makes the legs look a little longer, like six finger bubble. It's better that way, you know, in the angle, it just you just see this little piece coming out from that side. Again, four finger bubble, then another bubble, six finger bubble, a four finger bubble, and another bubble, six finger bubble. And because it's a bracelet this time, uh, it's gonna be uh, good enough, you know, this piece to go around the waist of the kids or adults. Okay, so you have this. You see how simple it is? Look, and I like this to make it one longer because it plays with the shape of what is a leaf, you know? So um, you you see it this way from on top. I like it, what do you think? <laughs> okay, now with this part, you just, if you want to make it into a bouquet, leave it like this, grab all the, the roses you make and make a nice bouquet. But this is especially this design, I like it into a bracelet. So you just make a hole there and get rid of the air, but just leave some there. I think it looks better if some air there a little bit. And then you just look, this is what I do. I'm going to grab only this part. So I grab my fingers. To the size I want, so and let's see. Oh, look, I grab it there, and I still have all this little space to pass it around. So I pull and pass it around, that's gonna be good enough to tie it there, so it's gonna be tight. And then there's the wrist one, and it's very comfortable. You have enough space there to make it, so and you know, people can see it from the top that way, and I think it looks really cute. It's a fast design, easy one. I've seen this technique, I think in order, you know, YouTube uh, tutorials. But uh, the idea more came because I saw that picture and I thought, yeah, it can work this way. So um, let me know what do you think. And I hope you have lots of ideas for Valentine's. You can share it with me because I'm kind of, uh, right now, I don't know what to do <laughs> out of tutorials. And I already, okay, this is the thing. Last year I started this, right? This uh, YouTube channel. So I have a lot of ideas, really cute ones and awesome ideas that I already teach last year and you can find it on my YouTube channel. You just go to the playlist you want to know more. Like for example, it's coming Valentine's. So go to my Valentine's playlist and you will see a lot of cool designs, you know, all about Valentine's. Or uh, what is coming in next? Easter. So you go to a playlist, that, I don't know if I made a playlist that's for Easter and you will find a lot of ideas. And the same with Christmas, Halloween and blah, blah, blah. Awesome. Hello. Hey, one more thing. If you like this video, if you are enjoying all of my videos here and this awesome YouTube channel about balloon twisting tutorials, don't forget, you can always donate because all you give money, it's very well appreciated for this channel to be better, you know? So you go um, go donate to my uh, PayPal account, alpacaglobal at gmail.com. And I will appreciate it for sure. <laughs> Thank you. Bye.